Mission Hero. British comedy A Bunch of Amateurs casts Burt Reynolds as a movie star out of his depth. It's so gross. It's so you. old. And has been. I don't believe it. You're Sean Connery. The film is given a royal world premiere in London's Leicester Square. It's a culture clash tale, landing its star in the middle of English nowhere. It's a fish out of water story. Um, an elderly Hollywood star, down on his luck, played by Burt Reynolds, yeah. funny bit of casting that, yeah. um, comes over to do a Shakespeare play to revive his career. So he thinks he's going to Stratford upon Avon to work with the Royal Shakespeare Company, but it doesn't turn out to be Stratford on Avon, it's Stratford St John right. in Suffolk. So he ends up working with this local amateur company, yeah, and so it's all the shenanigans that go on. This is it. This is our theatre. Royal leader! I don't recognise any of these people. Where's Judy Dench? Where's uh, Kenny Branagh? Just throw in one of the red graves. The Queen met the cast, which does include British acting greats. One well, is always um, conscious of critics. Um, and when it's the Queen of England watching it, I suppose it's, it's the ultimate critic. Well, it's great because it does give the film, you know, a bit more of a... Ooh, ooh, you know, it, it is different. There's no doubt about it. I mean, premieres are fantastic and, you know, and it's you know, one must never take it for granted. And then, But then you have a bit, you know, it, it just sort of puts another bit of a bit of a cherry on the icing. Can an action hero really be King Lear? To be and not to be. It's Hamlet. Welcome to A Bunch of Amateurs is the latest from the producer of Shakespeare in Love. You nervous? I'm terrified. One to watch out for. Nikki Finlay, Associated Press. A Bunch of Amateurs. Still.